guys, it's Queen Nija, and in today's video, I will be reacting right to episode 7 of the final season of Fruits Basket. It's gonna get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Alright, how you gonna make me cry today? Hmm. <laughs> this part just is not oh my god I just don't want to stay the fuck down <laughs> oh kill Yeah. It's huh. <laughs> a good question. <laughs> Just thing to be alone right now. Yeah, you know what you gotta do. Like, ah! What's up, my dogs? Cry today, but I know either between this shit or two eternity, one of these shows about to make me cry again today. This week, woo, God, yeah, mm -hmm. this is why we love anime so much. Ah, <laughs> oh, God. <sighs> I'm not ready for this. I'm never ready. Like, no.
Well, of course. But now, Cause she's jealous of her own fucking child. It's okay if you don't understand it now, but when you're older, you're older, Sand. It's so fucking cute. Oh my god, my baby! My husband knows! God, he's just... Mm -hmm. Oh, no, no, no. Your daughter was there. God, 
do you see how cold she looked at her inside eye? Oh my god! eyes like oh my god excuse me Who knows? You fucked everyone over such for a very long time, honey. I mean, you know, your mom bad, but you... Even though, still, she gets on my motherfucking nerves and sometimes I want to punch the shit out of her, I still pity her because you feel so fucking bad for her. Aw, oh, shit. You really gonna kill your own daughter? Doing this won't bring him back, though. Well, damn, you didn't have to do that. Oh. You just look so pure right there.
No, but she doesn't want him. She doesn't want her. She wants you. Mm -hmm. Of course. Wait! Oh my god, don't do this. Actually, what a show. Now look, I mean, there's nothing in there, so what else can you do?
Colonel, this is not the time to act like Kanye from my Kanye Joy, please! No! Okay, cause let me get up in the fucking grave was down. You fucking kidding me? You son of a bitch! Red's basket! Y'all need to stop, please! I swear to God! Y'all in the motherfucking cliffhanger! Stop it! Please! Like, come on, man! Oh my god, so much happened in this. Like, uh, to finally see her dad. The one person I have also have been waiting for such a long time. Oh my god, but like, ugh. Once again, Akito. Once again, I, I still fucking pity you. Yeah, sometimes I want to beat the shit out of you because I can't stand your ass, you and your mom. But I can see, like, her mom is bad, but she's way worse. They, they're they both very similar at times. Like, no matter how many times, like, I, I just, any moment when I see them or when I see her mom, I'm like, I want to beat the shit out of you because I can't stand you. But by the end of the series, I remember, like, <laughs> really, you know, <laughs> towards the end. Yeah, I changed my mind about Akito. <laughs> Still, even though, yeah, you bring him back all these memories I had and been like, oh god, I can't stand this motherfucking bitch right here. Oh, uh, you stabbed my husband, though, bitch. Even though he, he he's fine. He's gonna be okay. But still. <laughs> you, you got me triggered because of the thing you play your freaking career for fucking number drive. And it's like, oh, you about to die again. <laughs> Even though you're not about to die, but it just hurts so fucking much. And I love these characters, but just like, oh my god, I can't. This is too much. Like, oh my god, like too fucking much. My wrist, my hand still hurts. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, but thank you for not making me cry today. I mean, because like, okay. I like to compare Ren to, um... Not Ren, um, Akito's dad. Even when I read the manga, like, I, even though, like, when you officially meet him and stuff, and then the next thing you know, he's, he dies and stuff, like, I, I couldn't cry over him because we just initially met him. He's very similar to, um, What's Her Face from Symphogear in the very first episode, so, uh, if you haven't seen Symphogear, go ahead and stop the video right now, or just skip past this. <laughs> and go on to the next part of the video but um spoiler alert if you have not if you have seen it or if you just don't really care um one of the main characters like dies in the first episode of Simpho Gear, and I when I reacted to the first two episodes especially that first episode I literally could not cry over her because we literally just met this character I haven't spent ultimately like two three four episodes with her to get to know her a little bit more to really establish a connection with her or him whoever it is and then they die unlike with fucking and i still cannot believe this even till this day with the first episode of two Your eternity and how i quickly um established a bond and, and you know a relationship with the nameless boy and then by the end of the dm episode i'm over here a fucking mess over what the hell happened but yeah, I, I mean, like, this episode, whoo, God, <laughs> she, a lot of ish went down. I, I mean, and, and it's just like, oh, but that just, mm, oh, God, like, oh, she, <laughs> my God, like, you know, I'm like, what happened by this baby sister and everything, but I really wish, like, with whoever else was under, who hadn't, like, you know, ultimately left a keto and you know their powers with them changing into an animal i wish we got to see like you know everyone else there but no like 
<sighs> this is so much. <laughs> I love this show so much. So yes, thank you for not making me cry this week, but like, oh my god. Even, you know, when Ren's opening um, the box, and you know, like, there's nothing in here. Like, oh shit, like, mm. But just the look on her face, which is just pure despair, you're, oh my god, over upset. You could just feel that tension coming out of the screen, just oozing out of her, and just like, Look at her like there's nothing in this. So what the fuck? But like I understand why um one of the um what is the mm, I'm trying to think of the correct term to say. Um housekeepers? It would be housekeepers for them. I, I think yeah, they're housekeepers or they're workers in the series. I, I get why she was like, "Okay, we're going to put quote unquote his soul in there." And, but, you know, because Akito, at a young age, we, I think we were all like that with certain things. We're very curious to see what is inside something. So, of course, when she opened it, we all knew it was going to happen. And she's not surprised about, oh, hey, there's nothing in there. But, you know, she believed it. And at the same time, shit. So, I, I truly, purely understand that. But, like, bitch, you had to stab my fucking husband, though. The fuck is wrong with you? Bitch. <laughs> Like, what the fuck? Honestly. But other than that, guys, those very action views for episode 7 of the final season of Fruits Basket. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Monday for episode 8. Bye, guys.